What a scene it is here at Minute Maid Park. Once again, afternoon baseball. And it is game two of this division series. The Seattle Mariners and the Houston Astros with the Astros in their thrilling game one victory. They lead this series. Julio Rodriguez with a couple of hits in the opener. He leads off Ty France and Eugenio Suarez. Those top three were outstanding in game one. Kind of the Astros second ace behind Verlander B.A. He led all of the American League in innings pitch this year and added a cutter. So he's got the sinker, the cutter, and then, of course, 124 strikeouts on that big curveball. 17 season. Bouncing ball to short. Got to hurry with Rodriguez. No problem. With 90 wins. Back-to-back 90 win seasons for Seattle. And that one's in there. A call. Strike three. Sinking fastball at 95 miles an hour. 3-2. And Suarez hoists it in the air. Deep fly ball to right, but no problem. Tucker puts it away, and Fromber Valdez off to a 1-2-3 start. Dusty Baker and the Astros ready to roll now. Top three, Jose Altuve, Jeremy Pena, and Jordan Alvarez ready to get this one started. And one of the great leadoff hitters in the game, Jose Altuve, breaks his bat on the first pitch. And Castillo... Dug out by France. Castillo one pitch and one out. And let's set up this talented right-hander. One of the biggest acquisitions in Major League Baseball at the trade deadline. And he has been terrific for the Mariners. Castillo delivers to Pena. A swing and a miss. He struck him out. Went with a changeup right there. And Castillo delivers. And that one's right off the end of the back. The changeup. And Castillo goes through the Astros. One, two, three with a strikeout. A uh, swing at him is just wiped him out with a big curveball. See what Valdez has in mind for him here. Two strike pitch on the ground. Slow bouncer. Bregman fires. Bregman makes the play. Nicely done. Three up, three down again for Valdez. And Bregman, the rookie's going to get the ball. Right now it's Castillo, and Bregman leans on one. Lazy pop up. Crawford is out, will give way, and Moore puts it away for the out. And it's the trade deadline coming up, and you find out. Tucker sends one high and deep to right field. He's watching this one fly. And Kyle Tucker puts the Astros on the board. A roof scraper. Well, you see the 107 off the bat, 370. What I want to know, what was the hang time on that ball? I mean, that thing almost hit the top of the roof. It pumps you up. It believes they believe we can win this thing. Changes everything. Popped him up, Diaz. And it'll be Ty France, and he's got it. That will end the inning, but Kyle Tucker puts the Astros on the board. He had 30 in the regular season. Drove in 107. He's a slugger. The 0-2, swing and a miss, wiped him out. But it was a booming home run to right field. Stretch had lead at the time. That ball's hit well at the left. That's a short porch out there. And off the wall it goes. It bangs off of Alvarez. And there is the first hit of the game for the Mariners. And it comes from the red-hot J.P. Crawford, 19-foot wall. But... It is close. First ball swinging up the middle. Altuve throwing a first, and it's in time! Oh, what a play! I didn't think he had a chance. This is one of the fastest players in the league, Julio Rodriguez. And Jose Altuve, not known for his throwing arm, and you bet, that is in time for the out. Great pick by Guriel, the gold glover, and a defensive gem. To get Valdez out of the inning to the bottom of the third we go. That's a called strike three. Castillo burns off the outside edge. Gives a very few hits on the fastball. And that one at 99 and just carves him up. Maldonado strikes out. Two up, two down, two Ks. And a swing and a miss. So he goes with a changeup to get him. He strikes out the side in the third. For the Dominicans. Bouncing ball up the middle. Altuve again. Got a little more time here. And another pick by Guriel. Man, Altuve's putting on a defensive clinic already. 
He does have a gold glove. Seven, seven, eight. And he walks Suarez. Hanniger whistles one down the line. That hits the sidewall. Suarez on his way to third. Hanniger into second with a double. Got himself in a good count. And Mitch Hanniger with a base hit. See what he has in mind. Three and two. Santana on the ground. Slow roller. Gloved well. Going coming to the plate. Oh! Valdez throws it away. A run is in. Hanniger goes to third. And now going to get the run down. Santana between first and second. Altuve runs him down. Hanniger stays put. So it's the second out. Valdez with a wild throw to the plate. And we're all tied at one apiece as Suarez scores the run. And right here, you can see Hanniger never really an opportunity to break home. And the second out in the rundown. And a line drive to right down. A base hit. Dylan Moore on the first pitch delivers the Mariners in the lead. Two balls and a strike. And there he goes. And Raleigh into center field. Hits it on the line. But right at Jake Myers to end the inning. But the Mariners flip the scoreboard. And then Alex Bregman. And that one's driven into right center, a base hit. Rodriguez able to cut it off impressively. Throws to second up the line, and that'll be a double, a leadoff double for the rookie sensation, Jeremy Pena. Runner at second, he deals it. Alvarez skies one, left field. Not a lot of room over there, but Moore will put it away for the out. And a big out recorded. And Bregman off the end of the bat, sinking fast. Run down by Mitch Hanniger degree launch angle if you like to keep those numbers that one in the air right center field had him played there excellent positioning chalk one up to the Mariners analytics crew they had him in the right spots hitting in two and two and he got him just tied him up that one had some major run to it he, he did it a lot to be a lot like Castillo as he gets a swing and a miss and down goes Crawford swung at the first pitch his last time up and he's on the first one here center field coming in Myers gives way to Tucker and that will end the inning three up and three down Tampa mm -hmm. and really all year but let Ms. Diaz skies one into center field Rodriguez routine he'll put it away two up two down for Castillo here in the fifth two and two and that one is in there called strike three one two three inning Castillo getting stronger he's got six in a row and took the lead France on the ground Jeremy Pena got a great arm and France is retired one away here one to the count on Suarez a ah, swing at a miss got him to chase Suarez strikes out 3-2 pitch, and he misses with a breaking ball, and Hanniger is on again. It's a good sign that he's back in there. And he drives one down the right field line. That's down, and that'll one-hop off the fence. Hanniger on his way to third will stop there. Throw goes to second, and a belly flop double for Santana. Full count. Two outs, second and third. Here he comes, and it is outside for a ball. You're right with him, Frenchy. Her ball missed. Yeah. And Dusty Baker has a decision to make, and he's on his way. Valdez will exit. The bases are loaded. Pitching change at Minute Maid Park. Hector Neris in his first postseason. He delivers, and Raleigh pulls one on the ground. Shift is on. No problem for Pena. That's the end. And Neris. Showing some emotion. The one two. Ah, swing at him is down he goes. Just a darting fastball at 98. And he deals and Altuve skies one. A mile high. Just misses the roof. Raleigh's under it and he makes a catch. Jeremy Pena, the two one. Jam shot. Long run, Frazier. Coming in, Rodriguez. And that's going to fall. A base hit. In his prime at the plate in big games. And that one's hit well deep in the left field. And Alvarez has done it again. Oh, my goodness. 
He has put the Astros in front. A two-run home run makes it 3-2 to two Houston. Bregman pops it up. This will get him out of the inning. It's going to be Frazier who will make the call and the catch. A flare by Pena and Jordan Alvarez playing home run derby in front of his family from Cuba. He does it again. Alvarez visits the Crawford boxes. Frazier up the middle on a hop. That's Bregman over on the shift and he makes a play for the out. Three and one. And missed inside, and that's a walk. So the Mariners get a base runner. And Crawford is aboard for the second time. Crawford at first. The tying run. And a swing and a miss. He struck him out. Abreu with a slider. Dusty Baker back to his bullpen. He's got two outs with a runner at first. Ty France coming up, and here is Montero. We'll get the head start. Two outs. He's the tying run at first. There he goes. And France... Watches one go by, draws the walk. Montero delivers. That one's hit well to left. Alvarez closing in. He makes the catch. Suarez hit it like a bullet, but right at Alvarez. A swing and a foul tip right into the middle Raleigh. A strikeout for Castillo. The one-two. Uriel stings one to center field. And routine for Rodriguez. A lot of room out there. Number eight hitter. Pitch number nine. Diaz. That's a fair ball. Hits the sidewall. Crawford runs it down. Diaz on his way to second base with a double. Just inside the bag. And just past Eugenio Suarez, who was guarding the line anyway. Certainly his last. He deals it. Bouncing ball to short. Crawford is there. And that will retire the side. They made him work. And Castillo likely at the end of the line. Mariners down a run. They're coming to bat in the eighth. Little roll over ground ball. Bregman cuts it off. Throws on the run. Nice play for out number one. Three and two. And he takes a ball. Wow. Those two pitches he just laid off. Two balls, no strikes. Kelnick in the air to right field. Hit pretty well. Tucker is back. He'll make the catch. Oh, Kelnick just missed it by a click on the bat. And a long, loud out for out number two. And it's a called strike three. Raleigh is rung up. Montero rings the bell. Four big outs. But right now in this game, you put your best guy in, B.A., because you got to keep it a one-run game. And he's going to have 9-1, too. Yeah. Sends that one in the air. Deep center field. Rodriguez at the track will make the catch. Got it on the barrel. That look by Munoz tells it all. First ball swinging. And a little PFP. 3-1 on the put out. Two outs here for 3-2 pitch. Rides a fastball up and in. And Pena draws the walk. Oh, boy. Here he comes. Jordan Alvarez. Scott Service puts up the intentional pass. Now two men on. Bregman against Munoz. And he shoots one in the right field, a base hit. Hanniger got a good arm. He winds it up. Pena's on his way. And he is in there. Bregman comes through again. Four to two Astros. And he got him. Tucker strikes out. Munoz gets through it, but gives up a run in the process. And the Astros closer, Ryan Presley, is on to try to nail it down and give the Astros a commanding 2-0 lead in this best-of-five series. Presley deals. Frazier takes ball four. 
And just like that, the Mariners will bring the tying run to the plate now. Patient at bat by Adam Frazier. Presley deals. Crawford, a line drive out, and it's going to be a double play. Frazier in no man's land, nothing he could do. If that gets by Guriel, he might score. And a swing and a drive in the left center field. That's down and to the wall it goes. Julio Rodriguez on his way to second with a double. This kid's a star. Presley fires a swing and a miss. Maldonado blocks it. He'll throw it to first to secure it. And that's the ball game. The Astros win again. And they take a two games to none lead in this best of five division series. A win away from their sixth straight ALCS. And it is Jordan Alvarez who does it once again. The first player in Major League Baseball history to hit a walk-off homer and a go-ahead home run in the very next game. And this guy is on another planet right now.